The Point Cook RAF Museum recently underwent extensive refurbishments and today unveiled its new audiovisual display to Wyndham TV. The new display includes an F-111, an F-A-18 Hornet and a Canberra bomber. We spoke to the museum's director, Group Captain Robert Coops, regarding the refurbishments. They still look a bit like uh, 1946 outside, but uh, inside we've now embraced our uh, national aviation heritage and we show everything from the Australian Flying Corps, uh, which formed here at Point Cook in 1914, right through to the fast jets. The end result is this strike hangar, which we are going to formally recommission and reopen as part of reopening the RAF Museum. Visitors to the museum will experience the history and legacy of Australia's Air Force with a breathtaking display that brings these iconic aircraft to life. The newest display features dramatic audio visuals of the aircraft performing their respective tasks, accompanied by interviews with pilots. Shape, internal response, air power, and particularly the role of strike aircraft in delivering air power is really key to that. Through this display, visitors can learn more about the aircraft's history, their significance on the RAF, and the amazing feats they achieved while in service. The Point Cook RAF Base Museum is a great way to learn about the history of the RAF and its service personnel. The recent upgrades are sure to make it an even more enjoyable and informative experience for visitors. We've done our refurbished project, and on the 13th of April, we aim to relaunch and reopen the museum. It'll be on the basis of bookings. Visitors uh, to the museum will need to book in. Be sure to check out this amazing display when the museum reopens in April.